my name is Morgan and um, I have decided to start doing booktubing videos. Um, I'm really excited about it because I have loved other people's videos for a really long time now and I get really excited whenever they put up new videos and everything so just decided why not um, I'll give it a try and see how it goes. But um, I just wanted to use this video as kind of an intro video to tell you a little bit about myself, um, a little bit about why I read the books I do, what I like to read, what draws me to a book, um, stuff like that. So, um, unfortunately you can't see my whole bookshelf. I'm working on a way to try to figure that out, or maybe it just isn't possible without being so far away that you can't really see anything. Um, because unfortunately it's pretty tall. And I wanted to film for this one because I do have multiple bookshelves, just because these are my favorite ones. And, um, yeah. So, I'm gonna go ahead and get started. Um, this shelf is actually my to-be-read pile, so, um... I really need to get on that because it's pretty full. Um, but uh, I am hoping to read lots of these and get them done because uh, it sounds bad, like reading's a chore. But um, I'm getting lots for my birthday, at least I hope so, because I'm asking for a lot. And um, I'm out of room, so um, hopefully I can um, start reading a bunch and get further along in the shelf and then do reviews. But anyway, um, a little bit about what I like. If you can't tell, I love YA fiction, um, YA books in general. Um, the paranormal romance I like, but mostly, and contemporary I like, but mostly I'm drawn towards fantasy and adventure um, section in the bookstores because um, I really like other worlds. Um, I re this is my cat. Her name is Bagheera. I guess she wanted to be in the video. <laughs> um, but I really like um, not other worlds, because that'd be more like paranormal, but um, I really like futuristic, um, dystopian novels. Um, high fantasy is probably my favorite, but I will read the others and I will enjoy them. So, um, yeah. And then kind of character-wise, what I'm drawn to is I love a really strong female lead. Um, I like for love stories to develop more than just jump right in and be love at first sight. I'm not a huge fan of love at first sight in novels, just because I feel like it's overdone and a lot of times unrealistic. Um, uh, so I don't know. I'm, I'm really weird when it comes to my characters because I really like them to have depth and seem like real true to their character. Um, so yeah, I'm kind of weird when it comes to characters. But just a few series that I like. Um, I love Cassandra Clare's series, Mortal Instruments, Infernal Devices. Infernal Devices is by far my favorite though. Um, and I still can't decide if I like Jim or um, Will better. I don't know. It's hard. It's hard. But, um, and you can't see the shelf, but this has, like, Hungry Games Divergent, Wither, Scarlet, which is a great book that's, um, a retelling of Robin Hood. Read it if you haven't. Um, Under the Never Sky, and then Star Crossed, and Dreamless. Um, and then, but one of the series that I absolutely love is right here. It's the Demon King series. Um, the fourth one comes out, I want to say in October, and it's the final one, and I am so excited. Um, can't tell you. I just really like that series because, like I said, it kind of seems more realistic. The love story is kind of drawn out more, and so I just really like how it's developed. And then I love Vampire Academy because Rose is such a strong female lead. She can totally kick butt. She has her own will, and she doesn't let people walk all over her, and at the same time, she is a true human, has flaws and everything. So, I love this series. And Rochelle Mead. I love her writing style. Um, <laughs> but also, I like um, adult fiction, adult mystery, adult sci-fi. Um, I just recently got um, the first Game of Thrones. Well, not recently, but I've had the first Game of Thrones book for a while, but I think I'm going to pick it up very, very soon. I'm very excited about it. Um, I've heard it's so good. Um, I like Nicholas Sparks, even though not as much, after meeting him not that long ago. He's kind of rude and full of himself. That's okay. Um, I still probably read his book, so go him. Um, <laughs> and then I also like Danny Gabaldon series, um, Outlander. I've read Outlander and then the second one, Dragonfly and Amber. I'm halfway through. I had to put it down because it's not as fast-paced as the first, and I just kind of started to get worn out because they're so long. So I will be going back to that one soon. And then um, I love the Percy Jackson series, which is down here. You can't really see it. Um, and then I love James Patterson, which I'm going to meet him soon. So hopefully he 
ends up being really nice because that would be really disappointing because I love Maximum Ride and I just got the last one. I'm so excited. It's in the other room. I'll show you. Um, Nevermore, the last one in Maximum Ride series. I'm really hoping that I'm not disappointed and that it ends well. But anyway, I think that's everything I wanted to say. Um, but uh, before I go, this is something I want to try to do in every video. I'm always really curious what the people that I watch, um, such as the Arts Girl 12 or Story Siren or um, the Readables, I really like to know what they're reading even when they put up random videos. Um, so I am currently reading, so don't knock off my cat, um, The Selection by Kira Cass. Um, it's really good so far. I'm only 70 pages in, um, so it's about to take off. Um, it's kind of at that point where the plot is about to take off, but um, it's really good so far. It does remind me of a lot of other YA novels. I can't for some reason, I cannot think of what it reminds me of. But it reminds me a lot of some of the ones I've read. Kind of Cinder, in a way, but not, not as much. I don't know. I know there's one that's, like, very similar. That it's like, right on the tip of my tongue that I can't think of. But anyway, it's really good so far. You should read it if you haven't. Hopefully, it stays as good as it has been so far. But anyway, that's kind of all I wanted to say in this video. And I'll be uploading other videos soon. Do a birthday book haul later in the month. And, yeah. So I hope you enjoyed this, and I will talk to you guys later. Bye. <laughs>